Okay, so I'm making this video to show you how to use your fire stick. So, the first thing that you want to do when you plug in your fire stick is um, you want to go to settings. You want to scroll to the right. And then you go to system. Go to network. And you'll be able to connect to your Wi-Fi. So I'm already connected with my Wi-Fi here. So I don't need to worry about reconnecting. So you're on your Wi-Fi. I'm, I'm gonna leave it signed in. So you should be signed in uh, when you get the uh, Fire Stick. Next thing you want to do is you can either go to Cody from here, your apps. If you see it right there, those are Cody. So you can go through it through there, or if you don't see it on there, you can go through here. Go back to settings, go to applications, click on it, scroll all the way down where it says manage installed applications. It's the last option. Click on it, and then you go to Cody, this one. Once you open up Cody, and see how it's 16.1 that's the newest version so we click on a Cody there's a few options here launch application force stop uninstall clear data and clear uh, cache so what you want to make sure is that you never do is never click on either of these two clear data or clear cache that'll mess up the whole fire stick so don't ever do it even if you uh, feel like you want to make more room on your fire stick don't do that because that'll mess up Cody completely so just leave those two alone um, really the only thing you should ever click is pretty much launch application so you click on launch application and that's gonna open up your uh, your Cody okay so once you open up Cody you have several different options here you have pictures videos and music uh, the only thing we're gonna worry about is videos, the video add-ons. So I pretty much put the main video add-ons that you'll be using on here. <clears throat> Exodus, this one is for movies and TV shows. Stream all the sources. Uh, it's pretty much like Exodus. They have all kinds of movies and all kinds of uh, shows, even uh, movies that are still in theaters. Uh, one channel is that's a an older add-on. Um, it has movies um, and TV shows, but uh, the stuff's a little bit older on this one. So let's see here. We've got our most popular. Let's see what kind of movies they have in this one. Okay, so yeah, it has Deadpool, Star Wars. So yeah, it has a few newer movies, but uh, but yeah, like I was saying, um, I just put that a uh, you know as a backup, but uh, you should really have enough with these first two Exodus and stream all the sources. Um, you should have enough with those two, with those uh, two. Yeah, this one's just the backup. This one I just put in there just for for the heck of it. It's Columbia TV. Um, it just has a few uh, Spanish options, so just channels from Colombia. Um, that was one of the only Spanish uh, channels that I saw, so I just threw it on there. Pueden seguirme en mis redes sociales en Twitter, en Instagram, en arroba Rivera Mao, en Facebook, en Mauricio Rivera, descargar mi canción en Spotify y ver mi video en YouTube. Así que muchas gracias por acompañarme. Okay, so once you find something that you want to watch, you go to the add-on that you want, and say that you want to just check out what's on Columbia TV, you go on there, and you pick whatever, you know. There's a lot of stuff. So, telenovelas, let's click on telenovelas, let's see. So we click on telenovelas, and we wait. 
Okay, there's nothing on that one. So yeah, sometimes you, you might not find any uh, anything on the channel. But uh, you can just try a different link. So the, see, these are like the news. So once you uh, want to get out of it, see the remote. You want to click on the middle button, middle button, and then it opens up this menu. You click to the right or left. Since this is live, you can't really go uh, backwards. You can't rewind, and you can't go forward either. You can't fast forward because it's live. So what you want to do is, uh, you can either stop it or pause it. See. Once you stop it, which is this little option right here, the little square, once you stop it, it'll go back to the main menu. Then here, if you want to go back, you click on this back button right here, back, and then, uh, see, here you have Sports Devil. This one just pretty much is all sports live. So whenever there's any type of game, basketball, football, soccer, baseball, anything, you click on live sports. And uh, I like this channel right here, firstrowsports.eu. So right now, I don't know what kind of sports are on TV as of this moment, but uh, let's see if there's any golf games. You click on golf. Oh. Tennis. Let's see if there's any tennis matches. Okay, so there is. So it's 12:21. So let's see if there's anything. Let's see if that one works. So, okay, so it does work. See. And sometimes, uh, like I was saying, you know, if the link doesn't work, just try a different link. So see, this is a... See, then you go back. So that's just an example, you know. Um, that's just tennis, but whatever kind of game there is, you can look it up here. So if there's a football game, you should go to American Football. You click on it, and uh, it'll give you all the games that are going to be on that day and the times. Boxing. Also, today there's a, a few boxing uh, matches. So, oh, actually, that's WWE. So I guess it's on here too. Um, so this is just sports. And again, you go to uh, you go to Sports Devil. Click on it. Then you go to Live Sports. And again, I like First Row Sports EU. But once you, you, you know, you get it and you mess around with it and you start finding out different channels, this is just suggestions, you know, you can go wherever you want, but uh, say that you want to watch a movie, right? You go to Exodus, that's my favorite add-on right there. Then you just go to, uh, say that you don't have anything in mind, you just want maybe, uh, you want to see what kind of movies there are, so you just click on movies, and then if you want to go to maybe... Uh, most popular. Let's see what the most popular movies are right now. Click on it. So this is what's popular right now. Um, see, that's the original Ghostbusters, Star Trek, Captain America, um, The Revenant, The Dark Knight. So these are just the most popular. If you want to look at the most recent, um, Okay, or in theaters. Uh, the thing about the movies that are in theaters, uh, some of those are recorded with camera, so they don't, they're not that great quality. Some of them are really good, but some of them... Uh, see, for example, they have Suicide Squad, Star Trek, Jason Bourne. Suicide Squad might not even be in, on there just yet. But, uh, but some of them that are really new are recorded with the video camera. So let's see. Let's see if Ice Age is on already. It might not be because again they're too new, but uh, it's we can try to see. Okay, so there are I guess these might be recorded with the camera because this is a new, really 
It just came out in July. Oh, see? See, the quality's really bad. But it's on there. Okay, again, and then if you want to exit out, click on the middle. This is to rewind, pause, stop. As soon as you stop it, it goes back to the main menu. There you go. So let's see. Let's say that you want to watch a TV show. Go to TV show. Then you go to uh, most popular. And you can find pretty much any TV show here. So I like uh, the show Power. That's my favorite show right now. So we just go, you look for it, Breaking Bad, Bones, the 100, Power. Click on Power. Okay, the new episode came out on Sunday, so let's see if it's on there. So yeah, it's the third episode of Season 3, so let's see. You click on it. So right now what it's doing, it's getting all the different links, putting them together, and um, it's going to give you the options. So see, these are HD, they all have HD, some of them have SD, HD obviously would be the better quality, so if there's an HD link, that's one of the ones that I always try to use, and if one link doesn't work, again you can go to the next one, and that one doesn't work, you go to the next one, and the next one, and the next one, eventually you'll find a link that works. In most cases. Alright, so let's see. Alright, so it's starting. That's my show. Previously on power. There you go. It's high def. Looks good. Let's see? Alright, so let's stop it. Let's say that you want to watch a show, a certain show, and uh, you want to look for something. So you just go to here, again, you go to Exodus first, click on it, then you can click on search, and just go to TV shows, and let's see if we can find maybe some friends, the TV show. There you go, friends. Click on it. All ten seasons should be on there. Season one, two, three. See. And then you, everything is on here. You'll find every single episode of every single show. There you go. The one with Monica. The one with Rachel. The one with Phoebe's cookies. The one with Rachel's assistant. So you just click on one, whichever one you want to watch. It takes a few seconds to open up. Again, it's going to give you a few, a few set of links. Usually I go with the first link. So let's see. Okay, so the first link is HD. We'll click on it, see if it works. If it doesn't work, we go to um, we go to a different link. All right, so that one is working. So let's just wait. There you go. All right, so that's it. Okay, that was just a little demonstration on how you can use it. Once you're done, you just scroll to the scroll down here next to the little star. Click the middle button, exit, exit out. That's it. All right, and uh, the Fire Stick. There's no way to turn it off. So. What a lot of people do is they just leave it plugged in. It doesn't hurt. Some people don't like doing that. So all you, what you can do is just unplug it. And that's it. All right. Thank you.